Hey guys, so um, I'm just doing this little video here about this um, hand planing. This is going to be a headboard. It's black walnut, and you can see that this has about um, a five sixteen to um, quite a half inch uh, bow in it. So what I do is I always check with a straight edge, as you can see here. And you can see the gap in the middle. So I normally grab a pencil and I mark the edges where I need to plane. And I use um, a number five uh, bench planer. Uh, it lays really good on the wood for me. I, I like to work with this number. It's kind of handy and it's not too big, it's not too small. And it works really good. And um, basically I'm just start working my way, you know, through the edges and I check maybe every uh, five minutes of planing uh, before I get to like a, a flatter spot. This is obviously going to take a couple of hours to get it done but um, I'll give you guys some more videos on uh, how the pro progress goes. And I don't like to adjust the blade uh, too far out of the actual body of the, um, the planer. With simple words, you can just feel the actual knife just barely um, through the actual hole here. And I'm trying to say this with simple words, so guys, if you're just starting in woodworking, you understand what I'm saying. But um, uh, sometimes I push this particular hand planer, or I even pull on it. Sometimes pulling is a little easier than pushing, but um, in this case it's very easy because this slab is probably weights about 300 pounds, maybe a little more. It's about uh, four inches thick and it has a good stable weight to it so it won't move on you when you start working on it. So. Um, give you guys some more update on how this is going and um, how this is going to look when it's finished. Thanks for watching.